Hey friends, Steve Guttenberg here and I am the Audiophiliac. Today, I want to talk about the Kef LS50 speaker. It's been around a long time. I've reviewed it. Everybody has. Uh, Stereophile, the absolute set, you name it. Everybody's heard the speaker, loves the speaker for good reason. It's pretty freaking amazing. It is a modern classic. If you don't know what it looks like, uh, here's a quick gander. Looks like that. Sorry. And, um, uh, part of my photography there. Anyway, um, I'm amazed by this speaker. And I've been using it for a review that I'm working on now of the Shit uh, Freya uh, Stereo Preamp and the Vidor um, Power Amp. They're both made by Shit in California. And I've been using uh, the LS50 as one of my speakers for these reviews. And uh, it blows my mind. I was listening to the Kraftwerk um, 3D Blu-ray which I've been listening to it in 2D and in stereo. And even so, it's actually amazingly 3D sounding. This recording has steep bass transients. I mean, it's just freaky good this recording is. And the Kef LS50, man, it was giving it. It was not holding anything back. So, um, kind of blows my mind. Soundstage was huge, actually very 3D in the stereo mix. So, um, what else do I have to say? Um, I don't know. I, I feel like I've not appreciated this speaker enough for how good it really is. And uh, actually, every time I come back to it, I like it more than the last time. And that's not always the case with high-end audio or audio in general. Anyway, Steve Guttenberg here, the Audiophiliac, signing off from Brooklyn. Oh, and if you like these videos, please uh, subscribe to my YouTube channel. Please um, like them, share them, uh, tell all your buddies about them. Anyway, that's it. Steve Guttenberg, the Audiophiliac. Signing off from Brooklyn. And there she is. There she blows. Sorry. Sorry, sorry, sorry. God, this is harder to do than I thought. Oh, anyway, you get the gist. Sorry.